On October 25, 2024, the U.S. Congress published a document shedding light on the ongoing conflict between Israel and the Lebanese Hezbollah, a situation that has escalated significantly since the Hamas-led attacks on Israel in October 2023. The document outlines key aspects of the conflict, focusing on the advanced military capabilities employed by both sides and the significant losses incurred. In its response, Israel has concentrated on undermining Hezbollah's military infrastructure. This campaign has showcased Israel's formidable air power, heavily relying on precision-guided munitions, unmanned aerial vehicles, UAVs, and advanced electronic warfare capabilities. The Israeli Air Force, particularly with its fleet of F-35 Lightning II stealth fighters, has executed deep penetration missions into Lebanese and Syrian territories. These operations target Hezbollah's command centers and high-ranking leadership figures, reinforcing Israel's tactical advantage. Israel's networked command and control systems enable coordinated strikes that maximize precision while minimizing collateral damage. This capability has made Israeli forces exceptionally lethal in limited cross-border incursions, supported further by ground forces equipped with guided missiles and precision artillery. The role of Israel's electronic warfare units has been pivotal in disrupting Hezbollah's communications and tracking capabilities. By undermining the group's command structure, Israel has effectively targeted key figures within Hezbollah, including its long-standing leader, Hassan Nasrallah. This intelligence-driven approach highlights Israel's prowess in cyber and signals intelligence, allowing for the prediction and interception of Hezbollah's strategic maneuvers. Despite significant losses, Hezbollah maintains a substantial military arsenal, primarily sourced through its long-standing alliance with Iran. This arsenal includes precision-guided missiles, drones, and anti-tank weapons allowing Hezbollah to mount a sustained resistance and keep pressure on Israeli targets. Iran's advanced weaponry, including Fateh-110 and Zolfagar missiles, extends Hezbollah's reach, posing direct threats to Israeli population centers. Additionally, Hezbollah's anti-tank guided missiles, such as the Kornet, are effective against Israeli armor, complicating ground incursion efforts by Israel. The group's underground tunnel network across southern Lebanon provides a unique advantage, facilitating the movement of munitions and personnel while enabling surprise attacks from fortified positions. Despite Israel's efforts to locate and destroy segments of this network, it remains extensive and resilient, presenting significant challenges for Israeli forces. The involvement of the United States adds a critical layer of international support for Israel, both materially and diplomatically. The U.S. has invested heavily in Israel's defense systems, funding for the Iron Dome, David Sling, and aero missile defense systems that are essential for intercepting Hezbollah's rocket attacks. Moreover, the advanced military cooperation between the U.S. and Israel extends to intelligence sharing, bolstering Israel's capability to detect and neutralize Hezbollah's efforts to expand its military capabilities. The ongoing conflict between Israel and Hezbollah represents a complex interplay of advanced military capabilities, strategic intelligence operations, and significant international involvement. Both sides have sustained losses but the resilience of Hezbollah, coupled with the sophisticated military strategies employed by Israel, ensures that this conflict will remain a focal point of geopolitical tension in the region. The stakes are high, with both military and civilian populations feeling the impact of this escalation, and the international community continues to monitor the situation closely.